This is Roy Candy, and this is Favorite Game Friday. We have a group of contributors with completely different tastes in gaming talking about their favorite game in the category of the week. This week, we're talking all about board game resolutions. It's a new year. What do you want to do with your game collection or in board gaming? Is there a certain amount of games you want to try to get played? Are you doing some sort of crazy challenge? Do you want to cull more games out of your collection? Do you want to play more of the games you still have in shrink wrap? There's all sorts of awesome things you could plan to do within the new year in board gaming to make your year in gaming great. So make sure to leave those down in the comments down below and let's get to the contributors clips. I don't usually make New Year's resolutions, but with two four month olds, just getting games played is an accomplishment. So I guess I resolve to get games played. Hey folks, my resolution is to get some of the games played I haven't played on my shelf and to make more content for Calvin's Got Games. For me, I definitely want to play more games with my kids and just play more games with a lot of the audience that consumes board games here at the Dice Tower. Shrink, 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 shrink. I have so many games and shrink wrap still that I need to get played. That's my New Year's resolution is get a lot of these games played. Hey everybody, it's Mark. My board game resolution for this year is to spend more time gaming with my kids. So we're gonna start out with, well, not dead of winter. We're gonna start with Stuff Fables and see where it goes from there. My board gaming resolution for 2020 is to hopefully play as many games as possible with you, the fans of the Dice Tower, at any of the conventions I'm lucky enough to go to this year. Hopefully we can get a game in. My board game resolution for 2020 is to either myself or see someone score 300 points in tapestry because apparently that's a good score in that game. Mine is to create more board game media content. That's good. Hey there, it's Jen. And in 2020, I would like to actually finish a campaign game. It's always awesome to start a new year and see all the amazing things that are going to be coming in board gaming in the new year and then going back in the past and maybe playing some of those games you haven't got off the shelf yet. Make sure to leave in the comments down below what your board game resolutions are for 2020 and let's all just have fun playing games in this new year. If you like Favorite Game Friday, make sure to check out all of the people who are part of Favorite Game Friday and contribute. We have people from the internet joining in, so there is a Google Drive link down below that you can submit a video. Next week we're going to be talking all about the fa your favorite games of 2019. So we're looking to the future now. We're going to be looking back to the past and talking about the best games of 2019. Make sure to leave those um, in the Google Drive as a video and it'd be awesome to have you here on Favorite Game Friday. Anyway, I'll see you on the next one.